Hello, hello, welcome. My name is Kate, and if you're new here, welcome. If you're coming back, welcome back. I would like to do a reading. I hope I'm making eye contact with you. I'm guessing where the camera is. I hope this is awkward. So I would like to do a reading today. I wanted to check in with the carpet. I love that comment, that was awesome. At, that Karen Reed has. And to do that, I'm making eye contact with the camera. One time, I'll tell you guys that later. So I'm gonna ask a yes, no question with my yes, no cards and see if we're allowed to tap into the carpet that Karen Reed has in a cooler. I better be making eye contact with you because it's awkward. Oh, hold on. This is throwing me off, staring at you. Does this feel like eye contact? It's so awkward. I like looking over there where the speaker or the speaker is, but what I want to do is make eye contact with you to the point it's burning and Set the intention to, are we allowed to ask about the carpet that Karen has? You must be having a laugh. I am. This is for our friend who needed eye contact. One time, I'm just gonna tell this story anyway. Someone did something as rude to Famous Fortunes and he did an entire reading. Like, it was hilarious. I should watch him, he's funny. So I am, um, we got no answer on that one. Are we allowed to check? The answer is unsure. Staring intently at the camera. And I just want to see if we get one more unsure, we're gonna have to be, oh, I broke eye contact. Not possible. All right. I kind of knew that was going to I kind of knew that was going to be the answer because the 34 Fairview has asked us not to not to If I when I edit this, if that's not the camera, it's going to be awkward for everyone. Okay, so we can't go into that. I'd like to Who do we want to go with? Oh, I can't look at my list. I'm staring intently at the camera. What do you want to do now? What should we do? Let's do a Karen reading. Let's do a, an angel reading for Karen, just to send her some light. I'd really like to do a reading though. So I have a busy weekend. I won't read the, I won't be around. So let's see what Karen needs to hear. It's so funny. What does Karen need to know? If, if that's not the camera. Karen, summertime. Five, red, oh, that's her root chakra. The dolphin, she needs to work on her breathing and selenite. <laughs> so, Karen, what cards we got if you're not in the bleachers and you need to make eye contact with me? We got Summer is taking action. Oh, staring. Summer is taking action. Red is her root chakra. Selenite Actually, selenite is activation and stimulation. And the dolphin is cosmic breath and sacred geometry. So for Miss Karen, what she needs to do, is it okay with you if I look down to read? 
I'm not making eye contact. Uh, if that's not the camera, I'm gonna be so bummed. I'm just, just so you know, I'm going to read this. All right, let's start with, let's start with the root chakra. She needs to, she's in her, of course she is. This is, sur, this is survival. So of course she's in her root chakra. <laughs> this is hurting my eyes. I'm like out of my zone. If this doesn't work, well, then we'll know, but this is Karen's root chakra. She's living in survival. It's not where you want to live, but it makes a lot of sense for her. What she could do is go into those spots. Like, what am I afraid of? That seems a little bit tough. I don't know. I don't know if I can like move the camera. This is a journey unto itself. Only boomers say that too. My mother said that one time. I'm like, you don't even watch them. What do you care? So guessing whoever that was. <laughs> what we're gonna do, okay, so for Miss Karen, what I think that Karen needs to do is take some time to breathe. She needs to give herself some space in the morning to center and breathe. Okay. So Karen, if you're watching this, I hope you like the eye contact. It's not always this awkward. We just got a comment that we needed to make more eye contact with the camera. So I'm over trying, I'm trying hard. Karen, if you're watching this, what you need to do is set aside some time in the morning. I know it's really obvious what's stressing you out right now, but if you can breathe and somehow release this to the universe, you're in God's hands, you know that, I know that. Everyone on the light side knows that you're in God's hands. And I'm, so set some time aside for yourself. You need to, you're going to need to. You're getting spiritually activated. If you've watched any of the other readings on you, um, you're part of a soul family and you put on this meat suit and volunteered for this. So you could ask your higher self why, <laughs> but it really is. I heard Turtle Boy, I heard Turtle Boy say the other day that you're the only one that can do it. And I believe that. I've been saying that since the day I started reading on you. This is, Start manifesting a new outcome. Oh, start manifesting the outcome. A speedy trial. Like every morning when you're breathing and going into this fear, manifest a quick outcome. There are so many books on it. Like, right, like this trial's over and my name is clear. I have an awesome job. Start putting that into the universe. It works. It really does. Um, the Edward Casey... Oh, the Edward Casey trick, it's called living the art of assumption. Three nights in a row, you have to do this. You fall as you're falling asleep, pretend you're climbing a ladder, like see your left hand, then your right hand, then your left hand, right hand, and your feet too, climbing ladder. In the morning when you wake up, right, I will not climb a ladder. Do that three nights in a row. And in a week, you'll be on a ladder. I promise it works. I swear to God, it's the coolest thing. That's called the law of assumption. You're living. I feel like I'm speaking with someone that's really doesn't have all the marbles, but it's not you. Don't worry. Um, the law of assumption is living in the end. Edward Casey talks about it all the time. What you want to do, excuse me, like you want to find the love of your life again or another one and have this court case be done and over and fast. So every morning when you wake up, you need to start breathing. Sorry, Karen, if you're actually watching this call me, I'll give you a real reading. This, but that is a real reading. And I'm getting like, you can speed this up. You have the power. So practice the law of assumption and I'll practice making eye contact with the camera and if this works, good, because don't get used to it. 
and Miss Karen, you're doing everything right. Let's just speed it up. If everyone, well, I don't know. You, it has to come from you. No one can do this work for you. I love you very much. And thanks for taking one for the team. Everyone else, thank you so much for coming. I love you. I'll see you later.